Welcome back to the Blitz City Podcast. I'm your host, Kobe Orr. And guys, I am so tired of discussing Coach Prime going to the Power 5 level to coach at whatever school has a coaching vacancy. Um, I'm very, I'm very tired. But of course, I have to keep y'all updated if you don't know. For those of you who don't know. Um, so there's been rumors recently about Nebraska targeting Coach Prime, reaching out to him, and that Coach Prime has verbally agreed to take the head coaching position at Nebraska. Now, that rumor came from a podcast on YouTube called Minister Society. They have a, have about 14,000 subscribers, um, and they, they're the ones who put that information out there to the internet. But this video isn't going to be long, by the way, because I'm going to tell y'all why it's not happening. Um, and this not and this ain't even coming from me. I don't think it's happening, but this isn't coming from me, right? Number one, it doesn't make sense to me, but this isn't coming from me. I'm gonna I'm gonna show y'all right now. So our very own Eric Strickland texted Deion Sanders prior to this segment and asked him if there's any truth to the rumors that Zach Smith said. And what did he say, Eric Strickland? In the words of Deion Primetime Sanders, he said, No truth to it, my brother. There that's right. When texted, when texting Coach Prime, Coach about the Nebraska job, Coach Prime responded, "It's not true. It's not true." So listen, Coach Prime's name is one of the hottest names in college football for every coaching vacancy that comes up. But some of these rumors just don't make sense. Like I could, I would see him going to Auburn before I see him going to Nebraska, and I don't, I don't even think he's a great fit for Auburn. I posted that. Why would he go to Nebraska? That does not fit him at all. Like, no. No, he's the one with the hot stock right now. If he wanted to hold out for a better Power 5 job, he could do that. He can do that. He can finish the season undefeated, win the Celebration Bowl, um, make an even bigger splash in the offseason of recruiting, and, you know, wait for somebody else to be on the hot seat at the Power 5 level because it's always going to be that every year and get a better job. He does not have to take Nebraska right now that's ridiculous that's absolutely ridiculous like i said you know with this kind of success i was this attention so i feel like y'all should you know we, we should just get used to it you should just get used to it um some rumors are going to make sense to where he's you know where he's being touted by and and some rumors like this just don't make any sense at all at least not to me like i can't see him in nebraska i think being who he is ACC, SCC, you know, I think he wants to stay in a warmer climate kind of place. I just can't see him in Nebraska. I cannot see him in Nebraska. I'm sorry. I'm sorry.